a flashy Apache. He went with two, Shangani and Dark Travel. Shangani ready. Dark Travel, the last one. 28.50, gates open, and they're racing. Arlington action dropped to be the back marker in the early stages. Well, Shangani on the wide outside loves to pursue a good early lead, but he's forced to work because Dark Travel and Armagam are the first two to show. So past us first time round, Dark Travel in front of Armagam. Then comes Shangani, trapped up a little bit deeper. Now Nebras won't give him the inside rail all that cheap. Further back then to Flashy Apache and Imperial Master. Zeus is very keen at the outside of Imperial Master, leaving Arlington Action Racing at the back of the field. Well, Dark Travel with a lightweight 50 kilos on her back takes him down towards the final 2,200 meters as the leader by three to four lanes over Armagam, who's at the head of the others in second. Shangani managed to get onto the rail in third. Nebras races alongside Flashy Apache and they share fourth with Zeus who races at the outside in sixth place and a good eight lanes from the leader past the 2000. Imperial Master is one from last leaving Arlington action at the rear of the field. 1900 meters out and the pace is hot and it's hot because Dark Travels taking the race by the scruff of the neck in front by about four lanes. Armagam is second. Then two lanes away to Shangani in third. Two and a half lengths back to Flashy Apache at the outside of Nebras. There's two lengths between Shangani and Nebras. Zeus is also in that bunch. They followed by Imperial Master. He's won from last and Arlington Action is at the rear through the halfway stage with 1,400 meters left to run and Dark Travel came back to her field. She's in front by a length and a half over Armagam who races away in second. Then comes Shangani red sleeve, stripe cap in third and no more than four lengths off the leader. Then two lengths away to Nebras and Flashy Apache. They together, they still share fourth position as they work their way down the side of the course. A further length and a half back to Zeus. Imperial Master is still one from last and Arlington Action sees them all. They're happy with their positions. There's been no change in the order with 1,000 metres left to run. Dark Travel is in front by two lengths of Armagam in second. Shangani is still third, a length and a half away to Nebras. The heavyweight stayers are racing a length between between them. Then came Flashy Apache. They followed by Zeus. That's in the blue cap at the outside of Imperial Master. And finally, Arlington Action. They homeward bound with a little over 700 meters left to run. And Dark Travel has been brave, but now the big guns start to assert. And Shangani, Armagam, and Nebras, the three of them, all moving at the same time. Imperial Master's been asked to close. Then comes Zeus, followed further back by Flashy Apache. Shangani, Armagam, half a length away to Nebras. Then came Imperial Master. Zeus was further back. It's a three-cornered contest in the Caradoc Gold Cup. Shangani outside. Nebras and Armagam in between them. 200 meters left to run, and Nebras has been building all the while. Shangani trying to fend him off. Armagam drops into third. Nebras with a narrow lead. Shangani fighting the good fight, but Nebras will beat Shangani. Third goes to Armagam, and then came Arlington Action in fourth. So Nebras, Nebras, the yellow sleeves and the blue cap was asked to work to get on terms with Shangani and Armagam, but Nebras will now take his career earnings to one and a half million rand with a win in the Caradoc Gold Cup sponsored by World Sports Betting. got that win in Nebras. He hasn't won for the 303 days, but uh, this is his trip. This is his race. He likes the big ones. Well done to Sean Terry, Al Adiyat, uh, bred and owned. And of course, uh, look who's standing next to me yet again today, Richard Faree. Lovely ride. And what a scrap with Keegan there. Yeah, look, uh, it was always going to be a ding-dong between the two of us. Uh, they're the strongest stayers in the race. And, um, you know, Nebras, what can I say? He's a, he's a little hero and he fights hard. And uh, look, today, he got a bit tired, but the line came in time and uh, 
you know, bear in mind he ran a week ago. Um, so it was like a gallop almost, and uh, you know, he was a fit horse, and you know, Mr. Terry is exceptional when it comes to uh, turning horses around and keeping them uh, ticking. So uh, well done to Mr. Terry. I remember jumping off the horse a week ago, and he's like, you know what, I'm running him in the 2.8. So <laughs> I was like, okay, great. You know, it was like a, a gallop, but the 300, I couldn't beat the filly, and um, you know, mm. from there I was just riding with the hands because it was a securing second, and, uh, you know, it's a bit sharp for him. So uh, everything just went smooth into this race and cantered down, and he felt really good, and, and the rest is history. Great, great fight um, to the other horse, and... Yeah, what can I say? It's just nice to be in the whiz box. Mr. Modest, a good day at the office again. Well done. Yeah, thank you very much. And also a special mention to the sponsors at Will Sports Betting and obviously my sponsors at uh, Winning Form. Thank you so much. Richard Furry. Thank you, sir. Sean Terry, please will you step into our uh, abode? Um, I think Richard summed it up very nicely there. Says, You're just so good at getting horses ready, you know, when they're ready to go. And he only ran seven days ago. Good, good training feet again. Yes, thank you. I mean, I'd love to take the credit, but uh, Nebros is such a professional. He's really a game soldier, and uh, he's an, is a privilege to train a horse with so much courage. And uh, I've got to say thank you, obviously, to Sheikh Khalifa for continue, continuing to support the yard, and obviously to Johan Malherba, who takes care of matters here. And, um, you know, what more can you ask for than a horse that just runs his heart out each and every time? Fantastic ride from Richard. He moved off the rail at precisely the right time and, and I think that played a big role. Uh, we, re we worked really hard for today. We, we got a few blood noses but we at least landed a blow. So well done to the team at home. I don't think there's ever been a big day with group races that you haven't had a winner so it just shows your stature. Well done. Yeah, thank you. As I say, we, 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 we try our best for these days and uh, I'm glad we got something. Thank you, Sean. Thank you. Right, Daniel's coming in to represent El Adiat. Uh, please come in and stand over there. Well done. I'm sorry your arm is not fixed yet, uh, but congratulations. Um, thank you, sir. Uh, I think Nebras uh, performed really well today, gave it uh, his all, and showed who the champion's there is. Oh, he's top class, and so is the OCB. It was a lovely match race. Uh, yeah, the second loss is really good. Shangani gave us a go. Uh, the two kilos off helped us, but a win's a win. Absolutely. Now, will you take the trophy for Al Adiat? I will. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel. Here we go. Here's Warwick uh, Governor from World Sports Betting. And uh, there's the trophy for the young man. And well done to Daniel, well done to Al Adiat, and of course, Sean Terry. Very good training feet. And how's Richard Ferry? I think uh, we don't need to add on to that. Now, before I speak to Warwick, I'd like to speak to the groom, and his name is Laser. Laser, if you'll come in, please, sir. Please come to Studio 88. Of course, we know what Studio 88 does for the grooms, and f well done to you. Lovely horse. Yeah, thanks, man. And uh, you've obviously been working for Sean quite a while. Yeah, I'm happy. And this is a uh, Group 3, uh, you, Group 2. You've got these before, Group 3? Yes, I've... Yeah. Well done to you, sir. Thanks to you too, sir. Thank you, Laser. Don't go. You've got a trophy here. Reino Duplessis. Thank you, Reino, for being on duty today for Studio 88. And uh, Laser, we've got pictures and all sorts that don't go anywhere. Well done. Thank you. Thank you, Laser. Now, Warwick, if you'll step back, I'm going to go back to this board over here. I think Warwick will want this back around here with the World Sports Betting. Warwick, uh, lovely to have you on course. Uh, we, we know what you guys do for racing. I mean, I've spoken to Bob already, Stephen. Uh, World Sports Betting coming into racing in a big way, as you always do. Agreed. You know, World Sports Betting always has a passion for racing. They've always had it. Warren Tanner's always a big fan of racing as well. Uh, you know, a big thanks goes out to Four Racing, our partners, as well as our team back home. Without them, this would never have been possible. Absolutely. Now, um, if people go into your site, they'll see how wonderful it is, and you give back to racing, I mean, you guys must be very proud. Excellent site, it's very user friendly, whenever any, any help anyone needs, we have 24 hour 7 support, you're more than welcome to contact us. I've got to know you, you're a very efficient man, thank you so much. Thank you very much. Warwick, there we go, Warwick Governor, thank you to the whole World Sports Betting team, thank you to Reino for being here from Studio 88 and yeah, what a lovely day we've had so far. One more to go, don't go anywhere, the match race materialised and it's Nebras from Shangani, 6 and 8, 3rd and 4th, one more to go out here at the Big T.